My name's Bo. I work for Motorsports Designs. Came on board about two years ago. Just pretty much uh, interested in the racing part, the racing industry. We pretty much use all three end products on the race uh, wraps. This material is uh, just super easy to work with. It, uh, you can put it on, and as long as you don't squeegee it on at first, you can reposition it and move it around where you need it on the car. Um, it has an air release quality to it so that you have to really work hard to put a bubble in this stuff. Most bubbles will, will work their way out, which gives, it, gives the material that smooth, consistent look throughout the whole wrap. It's not the type of material that you would put on your, the bumper of your car that you have to take a razor blade to get off. This stuff is uh, so much easier to work with and it comes off pretty easy after the race so that uh, you can put on next week's race wrap. I would say that probably 60% of the cars on the track are probably painted and the other 40 are probably wraps. You see a lot more people going towards wraps these days just from uh, a convenience standpoint. And plus with the, uh, the technology these days of uh, being able to print uh, on the vinyl, you, anything you can imagine you can pretty much print it on vinyl and then put it on the car. One of the biggest advantages to uh, wrapping race cars these days is there's so much sponsor change that if a uh, particular car owner or team changes sponsors in the middle of the week, it's pretty difficult to paint a car and, and get their design on the car by the, by the time they have to leave for the, the track on Thursday or Friday. On Sunday afternoons, you can pick out the cars that have been wrapped and you know you can kind of point out the ones that you've wrapped or maybe that Motorsports Designs provides the wraps for. The wraps generally have a lot more design in them, a lot more artistic uh, flair to them. Whereas the painted ones maybe, I don't know, for lack of a better term, that's loud. They don't really stand out as well. And it's fun to sit around on a Sunday afternoon with your buddies or your wife and kids and say, hey, you know, we did that car this week. 